Escape from the ruins. We have the ruins at the bottom of the sea. This is a very, very tricky level. One thing is it has those blocks, which get triggered by switches. But we're going to roll down first, because I want to. So the first thing we get to do is come over here. This is actually kind of an interesting little level. this first, I guess. I wasn't actually aiming... Well, this could make things a little interesting. Ah. Yep, that was expected. Ah, but where there's a whale, there's a way. Not quite, though, there, I guess. Alright, let me uh, leave the room, as usual, to reset the guys. Really? That part's a little annoying. Oh my gosh. Yes, I really dislike that. I wish I hadn't broken the floor yet. That gives me the space I need, though. It's much easier when you have two blocks to work with than that one. Money's precious on this level. Ah, and I did it again. <sighs> oh, for goodness sakes. Except then when I get up there, I'm like, oh, I wasn't even expecting. There. As you can see, we're, there's the underwater part, so yeah, definitely a temple. This level actually shows a pretty good em emphasis on the word temple. So now we can actually come down this way. This is the part I was thinking of. So we're going to come down here first, grab some coins. This level is very uh, notorious for hiding things in small spots. Alright, we're going to come over this way now. Duck down. Go figure, there's more on the other side of course, but you know. They at least make this side semi-easy. You can get even more coins right here. I wasn't sure I was going to make that. I'm just going to get rid of that guy. So I believe this way leads further into the temple, if I'm not mistaken. <laughs> and I'm not ready to go this far into the temple, so we're going to come out because we want to grab as much money as we can now, before later. And the way to do that is that. And then you can bash over here, claim some more money, always good thing to have money. That moves these blocks over so you can get that. Bash him, work your way over. That means you can get up here, which by the way, that's stealing. There's nothing up there. Here's the treasure room. I think we'll just do it now. Oh, hope we can do this. There's still a lot more money we could go and get if needed, so... I'm not too concerned. Hey, look! He's popping up a lot, isn't he? And I got him! Dang diggity dog, I got him. Oh, treasure, here we come! Make spoil, please. A lightning bolt of some sort. A lightning bolt of some description. Uh, a description. Alright, just smack him already. I don't remember which way is the way to go. Because one way leads to a boss. Alright. And one way leads to another goal, and I'm not sure which to take first. Uh, fortunately, this is like the easiest one to get. 
Yeah, you can always just knock those guys right out with each other. That makes that task very easy. That works. Alrighty, we're, uh, we're progressing. Progressively. Alright, take care of him and jump up. Alright, we're going on this side, obviously. There's no reason to hit the switch, because otherwise I can't get up. Which is unfortunate. You can just remove those guys for now. Yeah, this, so this section is actually kind of in pain, to say the least. Just smash him. Yeah, go figure, more stars. Oh, I didn't think I'd actually be hit by that. Alright, so there's actually a couple secrets, a few more secrets to come. Now, of course, be careful. Ow, I said be careful, but I ignored my own advice. Oh, jeez. Alright, this is the way, I believe. Yes, indeed. Alright, so there's some secrets in this room that are pretty fun. You might not even realize you're missing. What you want to do is this. Here's the switch that will turn the platform again, however... We want to go this way instead and get some of those coins. There's even more coins if we go up this way. Just bash through there and down. And money! Easy as that. There's even more coins this way, how about that? Man, look at all the coins that are hidden in the walls. That one is nothing. So is this one. And if we go this way... Blocked, as you can see. And that's right, you have to sort of pick a goal. I am going to take the boss fight this time around, and then we'll just race here because this is really not that hard to do. Alright, so this is the boss fight, and maybe when I come back in, I'll just come back here to show off the second goal. The boss, uh, I'm actually going to lose to deliberately first to show the other sequence, but uh, this guy's actually pretty easy to fight. Basically, just come down in front of him and let him gulp you. See? Then he goes up the water, he closes his eyes a moment, doesn't he? No, he just spits you out. That's a different boss I'm thinking of. Not in this game, I guess. Yeah, so, uh, the first thing we want to do... Come down here. Smash him. Start rolling, and boom. Easy funds. Yeah, a couple more coins to grab. Yeah, I was gonna say, I don't think there's anything there, but I'll check. And then if you come right there, it just puts you right here, which literally not even that far from the boss. Now let's deal with the boss. Indeed, let us defeat this vile beast. He's very easy to defeat. He is quite simple. Do you remember the large versions of them? You merely have to hit him on his underside. See, there's two hits. See, that's how easy he is. But we're not done yet, he takes a couple hits. Now, in this part, it's a little trickier. Ooh, that was close, he almost gulped me. Alright, well, I'll come back with another video, uh, you know, part two, basically, of this story. We'll get this boss yet. Without further ado, it's time to fight the Wrangler fish. The Glowfish, whatever you call them. Eh, uh, Wrangler fish, maybe? Yeah, basically, he sticks to the bottom unless he sees you. 
And uh, in the first few parts, he just slows down, making him very easy to hit. What? I've been gulped. Alright, I'll be back. And I accidentally, instead of hitting pause video, stopped the recording, so I'll have to couple the videos together. But that's okay. Easily done. Come on, you, you know you want me. Doo -doo. There's one hit. He's really uh, taking this a beating. Yeah, make sure you try to hit closer to the back of him. I'm gonna actually get on the other side so I can get as high as I can. Oh, I tried to get away. One moment. Okay, try again. This guy's really proven tough. You know, I'm glad. Said he was in not that tough, but I, he's a lot harder than he looks. Still, it is worth beating him. Say so you've achieved both victories for the level. Close. Got him! Finally, you have to hit the rear end, and it's not easy. And then he flips upside down and gets tossed out of the arena because Wario is the victor. I don't know why he's not swimming, but. Yes, indeed. That ends that level that way. It's the different way to win it. As if you do it this way, then you're basically continuing the normal story. Whereas if you did it the other way around, you'd actually complete it to a bonus ending. Oh, oops, I could've stopped that a while ago. At least I stopped it on a 50. And there it is. But yeah, normally this would take you to this level. Unfortunately, that's not what we want to do. And I was just going to cut the footage, but I think we'll just keep the footage, ro footage rolling. It'll be a longer episode than I'm used to, but it'll be okay. And I have no need to collect any coins in this level, so... I'm just going to go to these guys so I can get out of them. <laughs> that was a lucky break. Yeah, we don't need to worry about the treasure room, thank goodness. Yeah, this level's nice compared to the next level. I don't mean saying I'm not looking forward to this fifth story of this chapter. Although the boss is pretty funny. So you've probably been wondering, well, where is the other ending? You may have remembered there is an alternate path for us to take we never took. Yeah, that's the only thing. I really don't care if I get hit at this point. If I lose all my coins, big big whoop. We got lots of money saved up. All we have to do is boop, go this way. Dash that, which well, what is that? No, there's not. Okay, I'm like, was there a secret there? I'm not. I don't remember. Sometimes it's tough to remember. Yeah, then all you really gotta do.
Well, I might just end this level with no coins. Yeah, bonus ending is actually kind of fun to get to. Uh, not easy if you get smashed, so I'll try not to. Nope, oh, like I just did. I should have just pushed him. There literally is no reason to be hit by a spring at this point. This part's a little tricky. It actually adds a whole new section to the level. That's the appropriate way to win. There's our goal. But I will show off the rest of this. Now, how do we get to this goal? It's pretty simple, really. Just like that. Alright, there's the goal! Because yeah, if you fell down there, you couldn't do anything. That ends the level the proper way. And I got the treasure, so... This lets us get to the final story. Captured Syrup! That's right, she's been captured this time. <laughs> Go figure. Alright, I'll be back shortly.